setbacks, pride, frustration. Um, in the last couple of days, an injury I had last year, which I thought I got rid of, has resurfaced, and it's really frustrating. Just come out of nowhere, no idea where that's come from. Um, it's something that I uh, I developed after the first race of the Grand Slam last year. Um, I ran through it, I managed it, it was fine. Um, it got me through the whole of the Grand Slam. Um, it hurts a little bit in the first few minutes of the run, then it's fine. Uh, but then I'm hobbling around the house uh, and it's a bit achy bit uncomfortable the rest of the time so this morning I was in two minds I, I took a rest day uh, Monday as usual took a rest day Tuesday um, an extra rest day because my groin was playing up actually but this time around it's my ankle um, and uh, yesterday I went out for a run with Paul Pickford which I loved great fun on the trails it's a bit sketchy to start with, but after that it was absolutely fine. The rest of the day actually it was pretty okay. Um, not as uncomfortable last night as the night before. Um, this morning I got up and you know it was a bit uncomfortable walking down the stairs, walking around. Um, had some advice from a good friend to rest, which I promptly ignored, which is exactly what I would advise him to do. Um, and started out and thought, what are you doing? The first like five minutes or so it was really uncomfortable, and uh, and um, what I then what I then found was that as I eased into the run, it's okay, and it's like last year. Um, so it's one of those frustrating things. It's difficult to know what to do. Um, part of you says, "Stop being so proud. Stop being an idiot." and uh, just rest, um, a week's rest probably would do me good. But then part of me also says, do you know what, it's a little bit of a niggle, it's fine, um, it's not getting worse, but then maybe I'm gonna make it worse. So it's, it's, those, it's those questions that we have about these injuries. And when we're runners, we just wanna run, and get frustrated. Um, we don't want to stop. Sometimes we need to. Um, so, I don't know. I've got a big run coming up on Tuesday. Um, I'm going to see how it is today. I'm minded to maybe take a few days off and just give it a chance to settle. Uh, but hopefully it's, it's going to sort itself out and uh, we'll be good. But, hey, runner's problems. Uh, when we don't run because we're injured, we're miserable. When we run because we're injured, we get frustrated by ourselves. So, hey ho, hopefully it's it's going to be nothing. And uh, I suppose my, my point with this particular video is sometimes it's really difficult to know what the right thing to do is. And as I've said in previous videos, <coughs> just need to make a decision and then adapt as we go. So I decided this morning to run. Actually, it feels like it's worked out okay. My, my, my foot feels okay. I'll find out later if it's worse than yesterday or if it's okay. Um, and then I'll make a decision based on that. So, um, but again, probably comes for a fall. Sometimes there's a point where you'd say, don't be an idiot, don't run. Um, I made that decision on Tuesday when I took an extra day off. Maybe it's time to just have you know have three four days off in a row and and see what happens um, and embrace the other side of me all the other hobbies I have apart from running yeah you know what I'm saying Alan Walsh <laughs> maybe I'll read some of those running books that have been sitting on my shelf for a while anyway have a great day everyone uh, onwards